Our dynamic Chief Minister of Goa, Dr. Pramodji, my <coughs> brotherly prospector and uh, dearest governor of uh, West Bengal, Dr. Ananda Boski, Roganji Tourism Minister, Honorable Damodar Mausu, his Eminence Cardinal, Pujanee Swamiji, Sri Pachamayanon, Sadhananda Anbade, our uh, former Rashtrapati's daughter Swadi Kohundi is here, Professor Harlal Menon is here. Distinguished guests and my dear friends. This is a very happy moment in my life. Of course, one reason is known to you. My three books are releasing today by eminent persons. The second thing is that, for me, it's more important. Today, Rajabhavan is extending sent to 384 patients by giving 90 lakhs rupees to them each patient 25,000 each. This is one of the great achievement of Govan people, Govan Raj Power. And of course our Chief Minister and our, his cabinet, they are kind enough, they rose to the occasion and uh, helping the Raj Bhavan for these charitable activities. When I started, of course, uh, with respect to my two books also, I would like to say, because of my village visit. Almost all areas I covered and our chief minister always cooperating with me, opposition leader cooperating with me and all the 40 MLS of Goa, they accompanied me, their cooperation was always there and that is why Last year, about 2 crore rupees were distributed to charitable organization. About 100 institutions and more than 1,100 patients. Dialysis patients as well as cancer patients. This year, now 384. All these patients are selected by concerned MLEs. They will have to give the list. And the, just like a postman, we are receiving it and giving it to them. And on that basis, medical uh, reports are also there. Then it is created the greatest achievement, this Rajabhavan. Of course, proudly say we are doing this work. And people of Goa are always extending their support to that Bhavan. And the inspiring factor, of course, Kovanji's daughter is here. While he was the Rashtrapati of uh, our nation, he inspired me, and uh, his support. By always he extended his support by way of uh, uh, some writing. In speech also, in Goa one speech also, he stated that this is one of the greatest achievements 
as far as rajivons are concerned i'm much obliged to all of you i'm not the going to express anything further but one thing is that under the system of law under the constitution if you be if we put a question to our sense people are supreme people are supreme whatever may be the position of governor or whatever it may be or chief minister whatever it may be, we are prepared to serve the people that is why we have this post so people are supreme that is why i traveled over the villages that experience of course one or one or two books i written on that aspect and uh, that is before you but my no i go i elicited certain things from the villages when i reached the village a sanskrit scholar told me the gods i some of these also there my i am always a nagpur uh, of our uh, archbishop first time a person who told me that not bonsai this is originated from our country 5000 years back old concept of our bonsai a name also passed on me by that pandit and that is why our udyan also in front of that stating that vamana vriksha kala now i am reaching 200 or 199 but or maybe i am not going to anything that sorry book is about the completion of a book vamana vriksha kala as far as possible i contacted grace colleges slogans are there and vamana vriksha kala started in our country about 5000 years back that through buddhist monks and preachers it went to china and then to japan also i according to my of course the word used may be there bonsai the name according to my information 400 years back japan put the name and now everybody in the world under the impression that this is originated from japan china is the you see exporting of bonsai china is in the top so a uh, book is written and this uh, forward also by our uh, honorable prime minister uh, i am uh, the chief minister maybe would be a prime minister aap to not say so he has uh, got these two books this uh, forward it is paid me much so i am requesting the honorable chief minister promote the endeavor of uh, rajyapovan extending aid to patients as well as helping the no writers so many schemes are there i am sure that he, our cabinet will extend more and more support i am requesting the cooperation of the people of goa may not the uh, talking much thank you very much for your uh, participation thank you very much jay thank you so much uh, his excellency the honorable governor of goa it's now time for inaugural of uh, the book release function and i would request the honorable chief minister of goa dr pramod sawant sir to kindly inaugurate the book release function and uh, inspire us all with his nice address thank you so much
for the book release function, the present along with me, Sri P.S. Sridharan Pillai, Honorable Governor of Goa, Dr. C.B. Anand Bose, Honorable Governor of the West Bengal, uh, His Excellency Cardinal, uh, Sri Rohan Khamti, the Tourism Minister, Government of Goa, uh, Sri Dabodar Bahi Maujo, the uh, Alpid Winner Puraskar, uh, His Holiness uh, Sadhguruji, all esteemed dignitaries, uh, our own friend Sri Sadhana Shri MP of uh, Rajya Sabha. Sri P.S. Sridharan Pillayji, the first uh, governor and who, who have taken and completed the Goa Gram Samriddhi Yatra, covering more than 400 villages in all the 40 assembly constituencies, reaching out to the people and grassroots uh, level leader. I have been a witness to his amazing personality in my own constituency and which he taught it an entire day, evincing even interest in temple, rich cultural, folklore and development in a very spirit. I deeply amazed and touched by his humanitarian approach by extending the financial assistance to dialysis and cancer patients from the uh, governor's, governor's fund to more than 1,000 beneficiaries. I was also privileged to be associated in releasing a two book authored by him in, in Kazikoda. It was overwhelming to know that Pillaji has reached milestone of completing his publishing of 200 books. I am extremely happy to know that Sri Pillaji is releasing the book on the heritage trees of Goa and he had been mentoring about it, our own discussions that and he was fascinated by the richness of Goa's nature and cultural heritage and that he would be like to write the books on the old trees and the Goa and exotic islands of Goa that is found heavily. The purpose was that the rest of the country and the world should know about these unique facts of the Goa's culture and it should be to help the tourists to explore the rich diversity and to it unknown. It was a wonderful idea and to endorse it wholeheartedly. In Goa trees were believed to be the dwelling the place of the gods and godliness or the holy spirits and even the evil spirits. Goa has an admired the traditions of respecting the gods worshipping the trees as protectors of the village and the people. Consequently, the existence of the scared trees and the growth, the familiar future of every nook and corner of the village of Goa and bears the testimony to the wisdom and the knowledge of our ancestors. Sri Honorable Governor Ji has undertaken the another yatra. It is an Samik dies in Kokni of the heritage trees that spread out in a different part of Goa. This book showcases an ancestral manner 31 unique trees and which are all the 100 years and more and they represent the wide variety of the species. The interesting aspect of these age-old trees is that and they are mostly located near the temple or the churches and enriched with the legend 